The search for the Troy missing family that went missing off the coast of Alaska has ended. The Alaska Dive Search and Rescue Recovery Team said on its Facebook page that if something is found or possibly found in the future, it will respond to assess what is, what is found if requested by the state's Department of Public Safety. Now let's take a look at the order of events leading up to this latest news. At 7 p.m. on August 3rd, a report was received by the Coast Guard that a 28-foot aluminum vessel with eight people aboard was taking on water about 16 miles west of Homer, Alaska. Coast Guard issued a radio broadcast to notify area vessels of the situation. The vessel Salty Sea arrived on the scene and rescued four people from a life raft. Next, the Coast Guard directed the launch of multiple assets to search for the other four missing people who were confirmed to be the Maynard family from Troy. But after searching for nearly 24 hours, suspended the search. That brings us to today, exactly two weeks after the original distress signal was received. The search for the Maynard family officially ends. Next Friday, the Troy community will come together to remember and honor the Maynard family. A celebration of life and candlelight vigil will be held in memory of David, Mary, Colton, and Brantley Maynard. A celebration of life event will take place from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Troy First Assembly of God, located at 722 West Main Street. Troy Baseball Association will then host the candlelight vigil at the baseball field at 815 in honor of baseball players Colton and Brantley. If you'd like to send flowers to the family, you can head over to fox44news.com for more details.